1951. I am Boneshwari, Huston Professor, School of Commerce in KSR College of Arts and Science for Women. Today, now we are going to see about Banking Theory, Law and Practice, Unit 3, Central Bank. Central Bank, a financial institution given privileged control over the production and distribution of money and credit for a nation or a group of nation. Meaning, uh, now we are going to see about simple meaning of central bank. A central bank is an independent national authority that conducts monetary policy, regulate banks and providing financial services, including economic research. Its goals are to stabilize the nation currency, keep unemployment low and prevent in inflation. Then next one is Reserve Bank of India. Reserve Bank of India is India's central bank. It controls the monetary policy concerning the national currency, the Indian rupee. The basic functions of the RBI are the issuance of currency to sustain monetary stability in India, to operate the currency and maintain the country credit system. Then next one is objectives of RBI to regulate the issue of banknotes to secure monetary stability in the country to meet the economic challenges by modernizing the monetary policy framework. Next one is functions of RBI. First one is the issue of bank's notes. The most important functions of RBI is the issuance of currency notes and coins except the one rupee note and coin which are the issued by the Ministry of Finance. All, all other notes bear the signature of the RBI governor. However, the agency of distribution of all notes and coins issued by the Government of India is the Reserve Bank of India. The next function is to the government. Another chief function of RBI is that it takes care of the banking needs to the government which includes maintaining and operating the deposit accounts of the government, collecting the receipt of funds and making payment on behalf of the government of India. It also represents the Indian government as member of the International Monetary Fund and the World Bank. Then third function is custodian of cash reserve of commercial bank. Commercial banks are required to maintain the cash reserves at a rate decided by the RBA in its monetary policy. Then third function is custodian of foreign exchange reserve. Another of the important functions of RBI is maintaining a reserve of foreign currency that enables the RBI to deal with any crisis situation. Then fifth function is lender of the lost resort. Often regarded as the banker of banks, the RBI act as a parent commercial banks in India. This it becomes the lender of the last resort of all banks when they are in a crisis situation. Thank you.